Hey, Max. Oh, hey. Everything okay, Max? What are you doing over there? <sighs> no, not really. I'm having a terrible day. You know, nothing seems to be going my way. So I'm going to go someplace far, far away. Like Australia. Wait, Australia? Yikes. No. I think we better tell them about the book of the week. Hi, readers. Today's book of the week is Alexander and the Terrible, Horrible, No Good, Very Bad Day. What was that? Oh, hey, Max. Oh, this day stinks. I just ran smack into a wall. Okay, Max, talk to us. What's going oh. on? Ever since I woke up, I've been having just an awful day. I woke up late, and before I even got out of bed, a mosquito bit me. Then, I went to wash my face, and I got soap in my eyes. I could tell that today was going to be a horrible, awful, no good day. I sat down to have a cup of tea, and I accidentally put salt in my tea instead of sugar. I needed to run out and do some errands, but I couldn't find my keys. Then, I was playing a game on my phone, and I walked into the wall. Why is this only happening to me? Australia, here I come. No, hold on, Max. Before you go, read the book of the week. <sighs> Fine. Alexander and the Terrible, Horrible, No Good, Very Bad Day is about a boy named Alexander who feels like he's having the worst day of his life. Kind of like Max. Everything seems to be going wrong for him. He wakes up with gum in his hair because he went to bed chewing gum. He has a cavity because he didn't take care of his teeth. And he even gets in an argument with his brothers and he loses his temper. And at school, his teacher tells him to be quiet because he sings too loud. And his best friend tells him that he's not his best friend anymore. And well, Alexander throws a fit. He's having a very bad day. His mom tells him that sometimes days are just like that. And as readers, we can see that a lot of Alexander's problems are preventable. Hey, let's go check in on Max and see how he's doing. Good idea. Hey, bud. So what'd you think? You guys, wow. This book really cheered me up. All right. Nice. Reading about Alexander's bad day made me realize that we all have bad days sometimes. And with a little bit of effort, I could have a good day. For example, before I go to bed, I'm going to close the window screen. When I'm washing my face, I'll take my time. When it's tea time, I'm going to pay extra attention. From now on, I'll keep my keys in the same spot so they are easier to find. And no more texting while walking. You know, most days are good. Some days are bad. Maybe Alexander and I can have a good day after all. That's the spirit, Max. Stay positive. Order your copy of Alexander and the Terrible. Horrible. No good. Very bad day. And don't forget, keep reading. I'm a book boy, yeah, that's me. I'm a book boy, I'm a, I'm a book boy. Oh yeah, we love to read.